Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I have an Avon haul for you. Um, yeah, it's really hot today. I feel kind of sweaty. I just filmed a, like, like get ready with me with my makeup and then I said I was going to do my hair and I turned on my flat iron and it's just too hot. It's We don't have our air on because it's been in the 50s and 60s and then all of a sudden we get these days where it's like 85 and humid. It's ridiculous. And my hair is like fuzzy and everything so it is what it is you guys. Just ignore it in my in my glisten. Oh. So anyways, um, I have a lot of stuff to haul for you guys, which I mentioned um, a lot of it is holiday stuff um, that will begin to be available with Campaign 23. But I'm wearing this t-shirt and I have a bralette on and it is fit and funky because of that. Sorry, anyways. <laughs> so um, a lot of that is holiday stuff, but I did, and, and that's not going to be available for purchase um, until next time, which Campaign 23 begins on the 16th, I believe. Um... And so we still are about a week away from there. And I did have some things that I hauled that were like core items. And I thought I would show those to you first. So these are just some things that I picked up um, that, you know, they are they are available for purchase now. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. Uh, the first thing I grabbed was uh, another tube of this Footworks Arthritis uh, Achy Foot and Muscle Cream. Um, I really like this. I think I mentioned before I had picked this up. Sometimes my left leg really bothers me. Um, by the time the evening rolls around, it feels very achy because it kind of draws in and um, where it draws in, it pulls on that muscle um, on the outside of my thigh and my calf. Um, and um, Keith usually has to do, we have a percussion massager and that helps break it out, but sometimes it feels better if he does it with his hands. And this works really, really well for that. I was really impressed with it. It feels very similar to um, like a muscle rub, you know, it's the same thing as like um, Icy Hot and those things. So it does have like a, a that sensation of that cool burn type feel. So if you're sensitive to those, then you wouldn't want to try this. But uh, overall, I really, really like this. And so we, uh, he said, you definitely need to pick up another tube. So I finally remembered to get um, one of those. And then um, in Campaign 22, the Skin So Soft products were buy one get one free and I ran out of my um, Silky Stay Shave Gel. So I grabbed two of these. Um, I really like these. I was using one of those razors that had the um, shave cream built in. But I felt like those were expensive and I was going through them quick. I like them because they were easier on my hands than putting shaving cream on and, and then shaving. But... I felt like they were really expensive and I didn't always think I got like the best shave with them. So I went ahead and bought some uh, disposable razors. I got the, well, I had a Venus razor um, and I really liked that. And then um, I had like some replacement heads for it and um, I needed some shaving gel. And so I ordered this because it was such a reasonable price and I really, really liked it. It stays put. It doesn't like run off in the water. You know what I mean? It's like thick and it, but it comes, it's a gel and then it turns into a lat, like a foam when you put it on. Um, I just really, really liked it. And so, um, since they were buy one, get one free, I grabbed two of them. Um, I am still using the Venus razor, but I have switched to the disposables, uh, at the moment because, um, I had a coupon and they were really inexpensive. It was something like $3 for like six of them or something. So I went ahead and grabbed them. Um, I did get another um, one of my black glimmer stick eyeliners. Uh, I went to use it and it was like I went to twist up and it was all gone. I'm like, no. So I had to grab another one. I've been using, I already opened it and I've been using it, but um, I was using the black and green almost all the time. You guys know that I was on this big kick where that was the only eyeliner I would use. Now I pretty much switched between this one, black and green, and cosmic brown. So um, I like all three of them equally as well but I don't want it to be without the black one. It's the non-waterproof, which is blackest black. Sometimes I get blackest night, I think, is the waterproof one. So I really like this, though. I think it's, um, I don't know, you guys. I've used a lot of eyeliners from high-end brands, and uh, I just, I'm impressed with these, you know, with these Avon eyeliners. They really impress me. That's all I use anymore. I don't use any other ones. Um, 
I had a Mac one that I liked that I got in a holiday kit a couple years ago. And when I went to replace it, I saw that it was like $18. And I'm like, oh, I don't like it that much. <laughs> you know, um, I just really, really, really like the uh, Glimmer Stick in the Blackest Black. And I like the Super Shock Gel Liner in the Black, whatever the black shade is for that. I really, really like that quite a bit. Um, I was out of my concealer that I get, the Ideal Nude Cream Concealer, um, and the color I was using was fair, and I felt like that was a little too light for me. It was really, 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 really light, and so I ended up picking up um, Almond, which is the next one up from fair. It has a little bit of a different tone to it. Um, let me see if I can get, oh, I can get it open, so let's swatch it. I didn't use it yet. Today I used, like in that video... I used the um, the Sephora. So this one looks like it has a little bit of a peachy kind of pink tone to it. I think it'll work though. Um, I really like this concealer a lot. The formula is great. I was using the Sephora Gel Serum before that and um, it's what I used in the Get Ready With Me video and it's just not the same. This is such a nice concealer. I just really, I know I need to do my nails. I really like the I don't know. I just really like the coverage that it gives. Um, it's nice. So, yeah, I'm a fan. I cannot get over how horrible my hair looks. As soon as <laughs> it's like sticking out and oh, it's awful. It's just a stinking weather, man, you guys. Ugh. Sorry. <laughs> Having a bad hair day. All right. So then I got also keeping in the makeup line. I picked up two eyeshadow quads. I actually tried to get four and two of the ones that I wanted were unavailable. Um, I know there's been some issues with a couple of, of the cosmetic products being on like a uh, back order right now. Avon does hope to have that resolved. I think it was a problem with the distributor. There was something going on with um, the factory. It wasn't anything major. It was just something. I can't remember exactly what it was. But um, So those issues should be resolved soon if you've noticed that you've tried to get something and you couldn't. So two of the eyeshadow quads that I wanted to get were um, unavailable right now. So I was like, well, that's okay. So I, ordered, so I got the two that were available. So the first one is uh, Purple Haze. Let me get it out of the box. I should have taken it, taken them out of the box uh, before I started the video. Um, I did not have this one, so I'm trying to, you know, have all the ones that I pick up all the ones that I don't have. I'm not like crazy about purples, but at the same time, every once in a while, I do like the idea of using them. So I did grab this one, the purple haze. And I'm really interested in this number one shade because it appears to be, let's swatch it. What do you say? Let's swatch it. It appears to be one of those ones that has like a shift to it. I know it's really light, but. Can you see it? That's really light. But it appears to be one of those ones that's kind of got like a pinky purple shift to it. Well, let's swatch the other. Let's swatch them while we're at it, huh? The number two shade here. We'll do the number three shade next. And the number four. Put that up a little bit more. So I don't know. We'll try that. We'll see how that goes. And then uh, there's another one here. Let me wipe these off. If I can get them off. I didn't bring a wipe. I just have a Kleenex. That's not all going to come off. Um, another one that I picked up, I could kick myself because it was one of the ones that I had and then I got rid of. So, yeah. And that's emerald cut and that's such a pretty one I'm like why did I get rid of it especially knowing how much I like greens I shouldn't have done that um, but this is a really nice one and it's not a scary green oh, it has a little foam applicator in there but you know I take those out so this is a really nice one and I love greens so I don't like I said I don't know why I got rid of it but I did because I'm a doof and so <laughs> and so uh, yeah but um I guess I could swatch these two. The number one shade probably will not show up. I'm going to try to do it over a little bit further. Go 
because that number one shade is really close to my skin tone. I'm going to do the darker one over here. So I don't know if these are going to show up just as a random swatch there. So there's one and two, three, and then I did number four down here. Kind of hard to see, I know. These were like impromptu swatches, and I got lotion on my arm, so I don't know. Hold on one second, I dropped my Kleenex. <laughs> so yeah, um, but I'll definitely be doing some stuff. You'll see that emerald cut, especially because I love it. I hate my hair. I decided to grow it back out a little bit longer so I can start wearing it back up again, but I'm going to keep bangs. So I need to get like this part trimmed, <laughs> this part that's sticking, this part that's pointing to the right. It's like, hey, you make a right turn. I don't know. Anyways. Okay. So then I also grabbed a perfume that I always talk about and say that I like, but I didn't um, have it. And that is the Amore in the Today, Tomorrow, Always um, line. I really like this perfume and I just, I never got it. And it's because I, I don't need perfume. You know, I need perfume like I need a hole in the head. But I, I always liked it. But they had a special um, for reps where we could get these, all the ones in this line for $10. So I was like, okay, I'm getting it. But look how pretty the bottle is, you guys. It's just gorgeous. And it's like a citrusy floral. It's definitely floral, but you pick up notes. Mm. It's so nice. But you pick up notes of citrus in it, too. It's just, it's really, and I love the bottle. I think it's beautiful. So I finally pulled the trigger on that. And then I grabbed some hand soap because there was a deal in that flyer. And you know what I'm going to do? I'll put all the product numbers in the description section below um, because I can't read, I don't have the book with me to show you what exactly, like, what was what. But um, these hand soaps were in one of the flyers, like the one of the beauty flyers and it was all three of them for $9.99 I think so you got the um, cucumber melon the pomegranate mango which is one of my favorite scents and I did use the uh, actually today I used my cucumber melon shower gel I finished that up I liked it it was nice and fresh and then the silky vanilla and they each come with a pump so I have three pumps also for each one of those um I just, we, I hadn't purchased these in a really long time. I bought, I mean, I bought the Avon hand soaps before, but it's been a really long time. So I was like, well, change it up a little. It'll be nice to uh, have something different. And um, the one we're using right now is getting towards the bottom. I think right now we're on a dial white tea or something like that. And then the last thing I got is available in Campaign 22, and it is the Sparkling Spider Necklace. I wasn't going to get any of the Halloween stuff, but then I saw one a fellow rep, she had ordered this, and she said how pretty it was, and she took a picture, and it was pretty. Um, it's not just for Halloween. It's like a really, really nice. So it's kind of like a, um, the chain is like a, a dark color. And there's the pendant. Look how pretty that is, though. Can you, there we go. Can you see? I mean, that's a really nice pendant. Yes, it's a spider, but still it's really, really nice. Don't look at my terrible fingernails. They need to be painted. I just thought it was really cute. So I ordered that while I could. You know, um, I got to tell you guys, I tried to order in Campaign 22 is that velvet choker. It's like the black velvet choker and it has that red stone, like that red square stone with the rhinestones around it. It was sold out already. And Campaign 22 has only been going on for a week. I couldn't believe it was already sold out. So I'm going to try to order it again because they might have like returns or something like that where I can get it. But I was like, are you serious? It's already sold out? What? So, yeah. That's that. So these are just like the regular items, except for the spider necklace. Everything else is available, you know, all the time. Um, and I will put the product numbers in the description section below. Also, on Thursday, the 11th, we are doing a uh, day of free shipping with a $25 order. So as far as I know, that's only for the one day. But sometimes Avon surprises us and they will extend it. And if they do, I will note that in the in the description sec in the description section. 
but that will be for Thursday the 11th. So I will put that in the description section also, as well as link to my e-store, as well as link to where you can join um, my Avon team if you're interested. Um, yeah, so definitely I will remember to do all that stuff. I didn't put my makeup in my campaign 22 video. I forgot. I was having trouble with YouTube that day or something. I don't remember. It was really late. And, and so I know, I know I need to go back and do that, but, um, I will put all the description, all the um, product numbers, especially for like the deal for the soaps, three for $10, because that's not in everything. And the um, buy one, get one free on the shave gel, which I really, really like that shave gel a lot. So um, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned because the holiday videos will be coming starting this weekend. That is my intention. Um, I've gotten everything together. We have... It, you know, we, we kind of got a plan. It's just, I wanted to show you guys some of the clothes and stuff and it just got really stinking hot. I'm like, how can I wear a sweater with a glittery reindeer on it when it's 85 degrees and so I'm sweating? I can't do it. <laughs> so, but it's supposed to be really cool this weekend down into the lower fifties and we have all those pretty pine trees out back. So I thought I would go out there and do a photo shoot of the holiday stuff. Um, so yeah. Okay. That's all. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. And I will see you soon in the next one.